Hey guys, in this short video, I'm gonna teach you how to add a button, that you create an image button, really what it is, on a info spot on your Cloud Panda Tour, just like this one right here. Get started, click this button, and it links out to an ex external web page, in this, in this case, Cloud Panda. So how do we do that? What do we do? All right, check this out, y'all. I'm gonna click Edit Tour here and then come back to this. Remember how in the previous videos, that I showed you when you click an info spot and you have this little need help right HTML link right here, click that link. It opens up this nice little editor, HTML editor for us. That's what we want. So we usually utilize this right side, this right column is ours. I'm gonna clear it out for now just so we can get started from the very beginning. I found a button hosted somewhere on the internet somewhere it's, and it's called, it has a get started on here. You can utilize uh, your own hosting for something like this. You can utilize a WordPress media file and find the link that way. Either way, you want to copy the image address. So I right, right click and I hit copy image address. Once I have one little HTML editor tool, I clicked insert image. Paste it right here as a source, click OK. Here it appears, it's pretty big, so I'm going to drag and drop it down some. I'm going to decrease the size some. Okay, I like that size right there. Highlight it, click insert or edit link. So I want to link somewhere. Maybe it's my client's website. Maybe it's the listing web website. Maybe it's Texas Lottery. I don't know. But we're gonna we're gonna type in uh, www.cloudpanda.com just for fun. Okay. Because that's the software we're using, y'all. It actually is gonna help me and correct me here. I need to add in HTTP. Semicolon forward slash forward slash. Yes, I do want to add that. So I'm going to click OK. Here's my code right here. Here's what I want. I want to copy this, copy all of it, select all, copy it. Go into Cloud Pano, HTML pop up, select all, paste it there, click Save Info Spot. OK, what's that going to look like? I click Publish. Think about your clients here. Think about the virtual tours you're creating, the VR tour company you're building. If they want to link somewhere, if you want to charge them more to do it, they click here, little button appears, get started. Cool, I wanna get started, they click it, and it takes them, takes them to a location, takes them to a place. This is important, right? If you wanna capture more leads, if you wanna send traffic to a certain location, to a site plan, to a, to a sign up form, there you go, it's right there. What I like too is with this little HTML editor, and I'm, not, I'm no HTML coder myself, but, I'm, but I can insert a couple breaks, I can put um, want more info, and what you'll notice is, too, this is just a basic HTML editor, right? Very, very simple. Um, but it still keeps things at, you know, if you can still add more information into there and you, you can customize as much as you want. So if, you want, if you're following me here, I'm going back into this tour. I'm clicking Edit Tour on Cloud Piano. I am going to this info spot. I just added a few more lines of text. Copy and paste, save info spot. I'm going to click Publish, and I'm going fast on purpose. Here is the output. You click on it. Want more info? Click Get Started. We could put whatever you want in that section, of course. Well, of course I want more info. I, lo I love this VR tour. Um, wh where do I send money? You can also do this with PayPal buttons. You can make an e-commerce store, VR, 360, all kinds of other things you can do. Um, really, the, the sky's the limit. So thanks for watching this video. If you have any questions, don't email me. Watch more of the video. I'll see you later.